My name is Maida Gary, and this is my piece um, demonstration on the importance of secret keeping. Um, this piece is part of a much larger series um, that I've been working on off and on for the last five or six years um, with kind of this overreaching theme of exploring the relationships between animals and people, um, whether that means the boundaries between them or the lack of boundaries between them, um, and both in a reality and a dreamlike or, or fantasy state. Um, most of the series is painted on exposed wood. Um, I really like working with the grain of the wood. Um, I, I build these panels and part of the process is picking out the grain and kind of working with that, which I feel like for the series in particular, just the subject matter, it also kind of ties in with this whole kind of man versus nature, um, you know, bringing this organic element that inherently ties to, to life um, into the image. Also, especially when working with um, this type of image, which I made with um, stencils, making stencils out of contact paper. Um, I like sort of posing these, this juxtaposition of these super graphic images against this really um, organic, flowing, moving wood grain. Um, another important element in this overall series is this idea of narrative. Um, I like to set up sort of this open-ended narrative, which in my mind I see as, as kind of this um, longer tale that's going on and maybe you just stumble across the scene and something's happening and um, you have enough to know that, that something's going on, some part of a larger story is happening, but then you have to sort of fill in the gaps from there. Um, and I think that the animal imagery works with this idea of storytelling just kind of historically with, with folklore or fables. Um, you know, people have always incorporated animals with certain characteristics like like the wolf is usually kind of the bad guy or like you have the wily fox coming in to trick everybody. Um, and the rabbit's usually, you know, the good guy and quiet. So um, in the storytelling I I tend to to play on those those preconceived notions of species and their their associations that we already have. Um, all of that being said, I will also say that this specific um, painting, the demonstration on the importance of secret keeping, um, the imagery for this actually I can't take credit for because it was a friend of mine. Um, in college, we used to um, go to um, various secluded places and just sit and have these conversations, which usually resulted in a what would you do if scenario. And this one night we had climbed up on top of a building, we were sitting there talking, and at some point he turns to me and he says, all right, what would you do right now, or we're sitting here in this building, if you just heard this sound behind you. And then you turned around and there was a wolf standing upright wearing a trench coat and holding a recorder and a microphone and he was recording everything you said. And I don't remember what my answer was. I might have said jump off the building. <laughs>